Okay, that's them in the chopper. All right, here's the deal. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight. Let's go. Got it? 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s, used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! I poked my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shoveled shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. Where's your car, honey? Nice shirt. I haven't got time for this. You can pass, okay? Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money! No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with! Wait, Sonny. You have my personal assurance that I'm gonna get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm gonna mail you the dicks of those responsible. Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm gonna let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. Go get some sleep, he says. 
I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are gonna come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we gonna do? Shut up, sit down, relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine, and then we're gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way, not gonna I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't gonna be a beer and strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go, come on. Who does that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with him? I like this shirt. Slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement Everything I do, so instinctive and so passionate Every word I move, so descriptive like an adjective I got a vendetta against people who patented it Being negative when you should be getting after it I got facts over facts over tracks This and that, spitting slow, spitting fast I could roast, I could gas, think I'm okay at last But I don't know if that can erase all the past And the pettiness, a reflection of the emptiness Hilarious, you think you're worth my time, you're delirious Mysterious, because you hide behind a fake exterior Inferior, you know I'll always be a bit superior Get off of me, this ain't no humble brag I want you to hear words, you can say them back I want you to feel free from the chains at last And to believe in what you got, it was built to last, yeah Now that I've been put through hell I never got anyone's help I had to do it all myself I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always
we show up and make a statement Gonna learn the consequence of being incompetent Mental health is confidence, dreams and some honestness I'm not here to save the day, that's for you to take away I could play a million mind games, but instead I say Something not illogical, something that is typical Grab it on and watch it go, make yourself unstoppable Dreams are irresponsible, but they're always possible If you just believe, you could be so remarkable Thoughts in my head, a collage and they spread I'll be great one day, going off of my meds No, I'm not giving up, no, I'm not giving in I will make it to the top, taking off in the wind I gotta make it, I'm saving every day to taste it I'm patient, but my mind, it can hardly take it I'm chasing a dream that I've had for several ages of bacon Modern kingdom for the taking Now that I've been put through hell I never got anyone's help I had to do it all myself Actually, take me to the proposition Will you be working for my father? Maybe. Do you mind me resting my hand in your lap? Maybe. It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. I'm sure you will. Well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it! Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slimeball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. Son.
Where'd you pop up from? I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know why I'm looking for some mate. English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. You Kent Paul? I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. Everybody's a comedian. Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate. It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. Yeah, that's right. Go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? Hey, what you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. Punch me! Oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some, too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh, yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. Well, no need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. This way! One thing you gotta realize about this town, you gotta pack some heat. The local gun shop is a couple of blocks away.
I'm gonna go see what I can dig up. I'll be watching you, Tommy. for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. Ah! Oh, oh, for God's sake, it's you. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna need new pants. Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon. Now, where is the goddamn money? Relax, relax. We're not at that point oh, yet. Oh, I thought that you were taking care of this. I really did. And now those Guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out. I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no. No! I tried that. The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. All right, more crap to wipe up. What did I do wrong in a past life? Dumb Florida moron.
can't believe this is happening! You know he's not guilty. Remember Giorgio? Remember he's innocent? No suntan. We ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, Tommy, what are you doing? I'm looking for the money, Sonny. Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style, because I seem to have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy, please. Do us both a favor. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. goes without saying. Tommy, Tommy, any progress? No, 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 no. Tell me later, tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party? Not in person. Howdy. Avery here has a proposition. <clears throat> Haven't we got other things on our mind? I'm trying to keep the wolves from the door. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any greaseballs giving you a hard time, I'll see to it they take a long dirt nap. Okay. What could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. The security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop by Raphael's for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, go for it. Should be a riot. If the balls drop like they should, stop by my office sometime. Who are these pricks anyway? Lawyer pricks, rug-wearing pricks, surrounded by... I'm not talking to you, Buzzy.
Yeah. Uh, this is Cortez. You were at my party? Yeah, I remember. Uh, Mr. Versetti, it was a most unfortunate incident that happened with your business deal. I know. I want you to know me and my people are doing their utmost to get to the bottom of it. If you'd like to talk to me more privately, you can find me at the boat, huh? Okay? Good day, senor. I totally don't know how to stop! Mr. Versetti. Colonel. Thank you for coming. Please sit. Lobster. No, thanks. Uh, I am ashamed to admit that one of the causes of our mutual problem appears to have been the loose tongue of a man I used to trust. I've been carrying Gonzalez for years, but now his incompetence reaches new heights. It's only right that you kill Gonzalez. Did he do it? It's the money that's important to me. For well, this kindness, I'll reward you. And then... We will find your money together. He will be at his penthouse, half drunk, probably. Use this. Speed your nose in. I'm gonna shut that big mouth of yours. Uh, he's got a blade. Stop running, you fat slime ball. Boy, for me, you cheap bastard. Oh, sweet Jesus. I've wasted my life and my looks. Stand still and I'll make it quick. Don't piss me off, man. Keep moving. I'll 
I'll pay you double, Tommy. Double! But you're squealing. No one cares, Pat, so... There is a dam 21 south, five point. There is a dam 21 south, five point. Come in and park yourself on the hide, son. Hell, my daddy used to say, never look a gift horse in the mouth. And by golly, he never did. Would you like a drop of the old Kentucky? No, thanks. A clean thinker. I like that. Now, the property business isn't all about highfalutin paper pushing. It's about dirt and the will to claim that dirt. You with me, son? Oh, yeah. Well, I need some tenacious bastard to let go of some dirt. And you look to me like the kind of guy to persuade him. Persuasion's my forte. Yeah, he'll be down at the country club, down on the golf course. They don't allow guns, so his bodyguards won't be packing lawgivers. Go beat eight tons of crap out of him. Here now, I got you a membership. And boy, you're gonna need more appropriate clothing. This guy's my new friend. I never had a friend with a weight before. me. Nice ass, baby.
is this guy? Boys, deal with him. Get him! Shoot! He hit me! SBF, I never wear that trap. Now look here, son. I got a problem, and I reckon you could help me with it. I'm no builder. No, I was thinking more of your demolition skills. Now this here, this is the development as planned, and this, this is the property that we're looking at. You're trying to say this new office block is kind of in the way. You catch on quick. Now I'm gonna head out of town for a while, and if that office development would have faced sudden and insurmountable structural problems, then I... As a civil-minded individual, you feel obliged to step in and save the rejuvenation of an important area of the city. Where can I get more guys like you?
What the f Gotta lay off the pills. I'm seeing shit.
sand messing around, I'll bust your wise ass toy! the human race. That's your woman.
The rain, she's straight what this time of the year. What? Ah, come on? Look, Cortez sent me. Just give me the damn chips. Oh, d'accord. Freeze imperialist American pig. That is property of a government français. Hand it over. You American idiot. They followed you here. Shoot him, bully. You got to do better, Mr. Stan. The answer was North West Ocean Beach. Get to the payphone in Rice Point.
Tomas, I appreciate your coming. Forgive me for getting straight to business. Diaz has asked me to oversee a minor business transaction. Let's hope it goes better than last time. Which is why I thought of you, my friend. I've dropped some protection at the multi-story car park. Pick it up, then go and watch over Diaz's men at the drop-off. Gracias, amigo. Diaz, huh? Apparently that angry midget runs this madhouse. Let's see what that creep has to do with things. Hogging all the action, I see. Look, you want to do something other than just shadowing me everywhere? Why don't you come along and show me if you're any use? I might just do that. The name's Lance, by the way. Tommy Versetti. Let's go. Watch where you tread. Must be called Tessa's new gun. Until more gainful opportunities arise. They'll be here any minute. We both better get a good vantage point. Okay, I'll take the balcony. You get the roof across the yard. We are in big time, man. Don't 
Don't you stand there, you creep! Chase the Haitian dickhead down! You stupid cock sucker! <laughs> I live! Take heads, and it's all down to you. What is your name? Tommy. I see you soon, amigo, I think. Shit, where's that guy, Lance? I want to thank you for looking out for me, my man. I asked that prick on set, he said you're the real deal, my friend. Will you not come see me? I need a guy like you. All I have now is dickheads. Dickheads everywhere, yo. I make you real rich. Thank you. 
My compliments on a job well done, Mr. Till. My client was very pleased. I have more work for you with a more hands-on approach. Your next job is taped under the phone.
Come on, baby, come on! Yeah! Yeah! Stupid uh. horse! I'll chop your head off! Uh. Who is this thickhead? Tommy Versetti. You remember me. Excuse me, I'm a little anxious. Never trust a goddamn horse! You do a good job. You work for me now. I work for money. As I said, amigo, you work for me now. I work Shut for up! Me. Some Judas has betrayed me. He thinks I don't know how much money I should be making. But stealing 3% is as good as stealing 100%. No one does this to me. No one. You follow him from his apartment, and you see where he goes. Later, we will kill him. This asshole thinks he can mess with me? If this is the best Vice City has to offer, this is gonna be easy. Don't push me. You don't want any. Oh, shit! Loser!
What kind of incompetent fool are you? Fool! 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 Tommy! What, Ricardo? These idiots, they're always trying to screw you. That's the problem with this business. What do you think you're doing? These pricks have failed me miserably. Soon any mom and pop will think they could sell Gallo in Vice City. What next, huh? The stinking mafia? That gang place is a fortress at ground level. So Quentin here, Quentin, Quentin! He'll fly you over the area. Eradicate them! What do you think you're doing? What are you doing here? Hey, I've been asking around. It's obvious that Diaz jumped the deal and iced my brother. And he'll kill you too. I can take Diaz. No, listen to me. I'll handle Diaz. He's beginning to trust me. What's with Quentin? I don't know. I always kind of liked it. Quentin Vance. Vance? You hate Vance Vance? Hey, I got enough of that in school. Last man, poor bastard. Where the hell are we headed anyway? Prawn Island. You ever fire one of those from a whirly? No, I'll get a bit of practice on the way though. Okay, we're almost there. We'll make a couple of passes. I'll take out as many guns as you can. Then I'll set you down and you're on your way. Thank you. 
for everything. Not so pleased with yourselves now, huh? <laughs> Whoa, watch where you're waving that thing. No more pigeon shit on my car, eh, Tommy? Guess not. <laughs> you're damn right. Now listen, you know who owns the fastest boat on the East Coast? Not offhand, no. Me! And I want it to stay that way. Every smuggler from here to Caracas has one dream. A faster boat. Rumor has it the boatyard has just completed such a vessel for some Costa Rican dickhead. And Tommy, I want that boat. Ah, I thought I got you! Where'd you come from? Pinhead! I think your ah! pigeons are back.